Hi, I'm Sherry from A Quilting Life. And I'm Chelsea from Chelsea Stratton Design. And we are here today to give you an up-close look of our brand new fabric collection, Seashore Drive. This collection is being shown to shop owners right now and will ship to stores in January 22, 2022. I've done a blog post on it already, but we thought there's nothing better than seeing it up close and in person on a video. Don't you agree? Definitely. Okay, so <laughs> we're going to get started and show you details of all the prints and just really let you get a great look at this collection that is definitely one of our favorites. Okay, so I'm going to go over a more close-up look at all of the different fabrics, colors, and designs in Seashore, Seashore Drive. So you know we love a good uh, ivory cream colorway. It's one of our favorite things to do. And so this is no exception. We have a lot of different low volume prints in Seashore Drive. And one of our favorites is our large multicolored floral print. This is great for backings, borders, just all of that stuff. And then something, and we have this in multiple colorways I'll be able to show you. This is one of our favorite prints. This print right here is the tone on tone print as well. And so it's great to add texture and for all of the backgrounds in all of your quilts. And we should tell them that this is a little bit lighter background palette. Yes. It doesn't go with the Motabella ivory that we normally use. It's yes. It's more of a Motabella porcelain. Yep. Motabella porcelain, it's a bit lighter and more bright. So it adds something a little bit new to this collection, but still mixes and matches well with our other collections. We have this fun multi cross print. Our text print is one of our very favorites has a lot of different beachy phrases and summer phrases. Uh, we have a fun medium floral and also this more compact medium floral that's in between small and medium. And also the same as the tone on tone, but in a multicolor, this uh, really uh, tiny, tiny print in the floral. Great for smaller piecing. So we have a good mix of large, medium, and small prints. And I wanted to point out on this one, it actually almost functions as a solid, don't you think? Yes, when for you sure. Use it as a background mm -hmm. with something else. I, I really found that that was the best way for me to use that print. Yeah, because the design is very close knit, right. it allows it to play as a solid, yeah. which is great for use. Right. Okay, so this is our ivory colorway. colorway. Mom is gonna take that. Okay, so our next couple of colorways. This color is gorgeous. It's a little bit different from the Happy Days. Uh, that one had a bit more green to it. I would say this is more chartreuse. Mm -hmm. uh, chartreuse, citrine, uh, very, very close. More of a yellow. More of a, a yellow than a green from Happy yeah. Days. Very bright, very fun. Still in that colorway family. So we have, you can see our, our medium floral in that. This is uh, our gingham print we're very excited about. It's a small gingham print as well as our cross print. And the same in our, this is really peachy pink. Uh, That's a good, I've been wondering yes. to call it soft coral, but I like No, it's, yeah, definitely good, yeah. more of a peachy pink. Yes. And we have that same medium floral in it. Another gingham, we've been using the ginghams for our bindings, uh, also regular piecing. Uh, it's very fun to do this on the bias for a binding as well. And then again, this small uh, print, this small floral print in the peachy coral. And you'll notice that we have this little bit lighter version and then a little bit darker peachy pink coral. And I have loved both. I mean, I love this whole collection, but yeah. it's been super fun for pops of color in our collection. Yes, definitely. Gives that springy, summery vibe. 
Okay, so we just couldn't help but bring back the orchid purplish colors from Balboa. And you'll notice that we added a little bit of a contrasting light purple to go with the darker that you see down here from Balboa. We really wanted that contrast. We have our cross print and we have our small floral and our medium floral. And then going into a little bit darker orchid color is our gingham and this medium floral with that pretty aqua flower in it. We have loved playing with the purples in Balboa and knew that we wanted to bring it back and it is very uh, refreshing to yes. have this colorway again. Yeah. And that's something we really love about this collection is we have multiple colorways in the collection. And I, th I think that really adds to the coastal vibe too. Definitely. You just see so many flowers at the seashore. Yes. Have this color, so. So we have this really soft uh, aqua color in our medium floral, very pretty. And our gingham again, we of course had to have two blues, an aqua and a teal in the, in the ginghams. We're really, really loving those right now. Our Love more- these daisies. Yeah, these daisies, they're one of my favorite prints. Yeah. And we have this actually specifically in multiple colorways. And then again, our large floral in an aqua multi-color way. Mom used this in her summer fun border. Really, really fun. And then we're going to move into a little bit darker teal colorway with the gingham, a uh, white, an ivory, a cream on teal. We like to do these colorways where it's not the multi. It uh, adds more variety to the collection. Yeah, I so, love those two color prints. Oh, yes. Borders, backings. Borders and backings. Yeah. And then we have another text print in the darker teal, just the two colorway, and another daisy medium yeah. floral, just we really, really love this print. Okay, so we are going to go into our final colorway. Uh, something we have obviously been loving is the grays and the charcoal, and after having that in uh, Balboa and Summer Sweet, we knew we wanted to go back after Happy Days to a gray colorway. And so we have the darker, the, the lighter gray and the contrasting darker, darker charcoal gray. So we have this in the large floral, in a very, very, in the very, very small floral. We have the lighter gray in the text print, in the crosses. And then moving into the contrasting with both is the gingham print. I love this one. I can't wait to mix this gingham in with fall. Yes. Uh, I just added this to actually a fall pillow I just made yeah. for the backing. Very, very pretty. This is one of my favorite. I'm so happy that we ended up choosing that for the gingham. Yes. It really is really fun in that dark gray. Yeah, it's very versatile. So yeah. you can use a lot of these colorways in different uh, projects throughout the year. This smaller charcoal floral and our medium multi-charcoal floral. Love the purple flowers in this one with the pink. And then a large multi, which is so fun for borders. Yes. I plan on making uh, pillows with this. It's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, and this has all most of the colors from the collection in just this print, just oh, like yeah. the ivory right. uh, version. So these are the colorways. Again, something I love, we have so many different colorways in this. I mean, you have your ivories, the pinks, the chartreuse, the blues, the purples, and it just is a well-rounded collection. We're very, very happy with this one, and we're loving sewing with it, and can't wait to see all of the different projects that you decide to make with it. Yeah, we've, we've had a blast sewing with it, and we can't wait to see everything that you will make as well. <laughs> Okay, that's it for our video. I hope that you enjoyed getting a really up close look at Seashore Drive. Once again, it does ship in January 2022. And if you love it, we would really appreciate it if you tell your favorite shops that you would love for them to order it. 
And if you like this video, please share it with a friend, subscribe to our channel if you haven't already, and hit the like button. Thanks so much for stopping by.